I'm Kevin Williams, and I'm on a mission to explain why science matters to motorcyclists via my 60 second science short video series. Today I'm looking at motorcycle instability. You've probably heard of wobble and weave, but you may not have heard of capsize, sometimes called overturn. It's simple enough, a motorcycle capsizes when it falls over. That's why we put bikes on a stand when stopped. At very slow speeds and riding with feet up, the bike can still capsize. We solve the problem by keeping the bike's mass centred over the wheels by turning the steering from side to side. Once rolling above a critical speed, my own experiments suggest about 5 metres per second or 11 miles per hour, the vast majority of motorcycles become straight line stable and no rider action is necessary to keep the bike upright. We can take our hands off the bars and the motorcycle will continue in a straight line. Weave is a side to side oscillation of the entire motorcycle three to four times per second. Older machines, as this mid 70s Dunlop video shows, often had poor high speed stability. Modern motorcycles are a lot more stable, but incorrect tyre inflation and wear issues, swing arm pivot wear, rider weight or heavy equipment, or deliberate changes to the machine's geometry can all cause a previously stable bike to weave. So can steering inputs or even turbulent air experience when passing a truck at speed. Keeping hands on the bars is usually enough to allow the weave to damp itself out, but the Dunlop team suggested leaning forward before slowing down. Wobble happens when the front steering assembly vibrates back and forth around the steering axis, just like this shopping trolley wheel. It occurs at a higher frequency, between 6 and 10 times a second, and can be triggered by wheel imbalance or road surface issues. Simply holding the bars normally damps out wobbles, but occasionally it can persist or even get worse, and then the rider would be lucky to avoid a crash. Weaves and wobbles are rarely an issue with a modern bike, and if they are, get your machine checked out. Thank you.